Huh, you're here. Kanich, Elder Trinidad said that... I can tell. It's written on your faces. Is that the Traveler and Paimon? Uh, forgive me for not being there to welcome you on your arrival. That should have been my duty as chief. Hello, Chief Waina. I only heard the news from Trinidad yesterday, so I asked Kenich to invite you over for a quick chat. <laughs> I believe Kenich has already filled you in, so I'll get straight to the point. Firstly, I fully endorse your appointment as flame bearers for the upcoming Turnfire Night. However, I would like to request that you take steps to ensure the Mountain King's safety. Every child of our tribe grows up hearing the tales of our heroes, from Yupanki the Firebringer to Burkina and the Mountain King who fought against the Abyss. This is our history and our heritage, the source of our pride and the center of our faith. To kill the Mountain King would be to destroy our spirit. I would never be able to face our ancestors in the Night Kingdom. Nana's death was a great tragedy, and I do not blame Trinidad for the actions he has taken. Nevertheless, I cannot allow any harm to come to the Mountain King. The very roots of our identity are at stake. <sighs> My honored guests, please give this matter your serious consideration. Perhaps there is, but despite all our attempts to contain the situation over the years, we have not found it. Right now, I should like to hear where you stand on this matter. Running away won't solve anything! You just need some time to think this through, that's all! Don't worry, we'll come up with something if we put our heads together. Thank you both. There are still three days left before the ceremony. I hope they will bring you clarity. So, Kanich, earlier you were saying that... Let's walk and talk. I'll show you around the tribe. That works too. Paimon needs to get some air after this. <laughs> <laughs> 